What is happening everyone? Welcome to another video on the Fox Tech YouTube channel. The topic for today is, as you can see, we have the iPhone going on and the topic is how you can take or edit product photos with your iPhone. So I have a bunch of stuff ready for you. First of all, if you want to take it really professionally, if you want to make sure that everything is done the perfect way, I would actually recommend you to get something like this. So you can see, you can go ahead and purchase this on Amazon. It's you know, like a portable studio where you place your product inside of that and you just fire up the lights and you can actually just take very beautiful photos of whatever subject you have there. So that would be nice, but in case you don't want to go that route and in case you already have some products, I'm going to show you how you can edit them on the iPhone. The products which are not really like made in a perfect way. So if I open up the photos, for example, this is a picture which I have. It's a product which I hold in my hand, whatever it is. Of course, I have the option to hold down on it within iOS and like grab it and paste it somewhere else, but I didn't really know what I would do with that except for sending it somewhere or saving it in the notes. Instead, what I would recommend you to do is to go ahead and look up the uh, CapCut video editor. I know it's a video editor, so for photos, it may not appear that it does actually anything, but this is what it looks like. This is the app, and I would recommend you to go ahead and download it. So open up the CapCut application like that and by default you will get to this main section and at the top you have multiple controls and also the new project section so I don't want you to click on new project but click on on the expand you can see right there there is the collapse and expand button and this reveals more options even so then I would recommend you to go and click on this remove background you can see it right here tap on the remove background now at first select the background image so I'll click on the image which is going to be in the background it's the same one which I use for the video as well so go ahead and add it there it's going to be uh, loaded up of course click on that confirm it no problem now at the bottom you have this little slider view and I want you to click on the photo so when you click on photo now just select the actual product this is not the one where we have it this one where I hold it in my hand so I'm going to click on that and I'm going to add it to this picture. Resize it, place it however you want, arrange it as you like. Now this is what it's looking like right now, but what we want to do and what's the basic point of actually product or doing product photography is deleting the background behind the product. So what we can do right now is to click on the layers right here, tap on the first layer, which is our product right here. And at the, uh, in the lower slider, you have the remove background. So tap on the remove background like this. And it's going to load up. And by default, it's going to give you the automatic selection, which in our case is perfect. Like I don't have to do anything with it. This is the product which has been selected by default. So that's really good. But I also have the option to use the quick select tool so I can quickly select portions. And it tries to guess what exactly I want to select or go completely manual where anything that I choose is actually selected. So that's what I can do. But I'm gonna come back to the auto select and hit the confirming button. Now I'm just gonna zoom it out a bit. And now I actually have a perfectly placed product. So that's really good, right? Now, whatever I wanna do, I can just export it. I can place it inside of anything. And also, if you want to, this background is nothing really professional, but you can put some desk in there or whatever you want. So yeah, it's up to you to decide what you want to do with it, but this would be my main process or of how I would get uh, the, the ball rolling and what I would do with my products. Anyways, before I'm going to wrap up this video, I need to show you this thing right here because this is the Fox Tech education platform. And here you can sign up for free. The link will be in the description down below. And you can watch video editing courses. There is the all apps explained. We're constantly adding new content to the page. You can watch everything here for free. It's really good. I've just added some new people and you can see there are people online and stuff. So that's really good. Definitely go ahead and check it out down below in the description. And I'm going to wrap up this video right now. I don't think that we need to make it any more in depth. This is my method. Of course, besides that, there are many ways how you can remove the background of the photos, but I like to use CapCut with it. Let me know what you think about it down below. And this is going to be the end of this video. Thanks a lot for watching. See you guys later.